Hi guys, welcome back to Team G Productions. My name is Tom and I'm joined by Jay. Welcome back. Well, welcome. Welcome ish. Welcome, welcome back. Ish back. back. At all. I'm here. Not welcome at all. He's wearing the t-shirts. We'll let him off. Uh, we are at Steamforge HQ. 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 You visited us today. It's a beautiful building. Mm, it's very, it's very nice. It's not bad. Um, and we are here to play some Guild Ball. That interview went well. That it's <laughs> So we are here to play some uh, Guild Ball. Uh, who are you going to be representing, mate? I'm bringing some butchers today. Some butchers. Slightly different. I'm going to take some ox butchers Some today. ox butchers mm. rather than usual fillet. I'm going to be playing engineers and rather than my usual pin vice, Ballista is going to be on the table. So we've both got the big season one dudes. We do. And we're um, doing uh, something exciting today. Well, a little twist. We are giving the new Exiles Gutter a run out. Yeah, Veteran Gutter is going to be on the field and the new game plan deck as yep, well, correct. which we'll be showing off. So we will go over to the roll off and we'll see you in a sec. Okay, here's Jay's butchers then, so I can immediately see who stands out in this lineup. He's new and scary, but who have you picked? So, I've gone with an Ox Butchers team. Um, I usually rule Philip, but I'm trying to climatize myself to Ox a bit. Yep. Uh, we've got Princess the Dog, because I always take Princess, because she is amazing. No uh, boiler, though. No boiler. I very rarely get... Princess is my intervening yeah. model, yeah. and she tends to run up the backfield holding the ball when I'm killing it, because I'm fun like that. Um, we got Meat Hook, just to do the defense debuff, get the bleed out. Because um, she's good at everything. Absolutely. She loves Ox's Aura, as they all do. Boar, because Boar, just pain train. Yeah. Uh, we've got the new shiny gutter. The beautifully painted beautiful gutter. gutter. Being very gentle with Very, gutter. very <laughs> gentle with <laughs> So, uh, I'm excited to try her. We've just, got, we've just read her rules, so we're going to give her a go. She's awesome. And we've got a model I don't really use often, yeah, but I want to get so used to, which is Vet Brisket, just for the... Above and beyond and everything. Exactly. Two golem, uh, nice girl threat. So, bit of a different Butchers team for me, but I'm looking forward to see how it goes. Decent footballing team. Yes. As well as damage. Yeah. So, we're going to have a look at the engineers next. Okay, and here are my engineers. And very much like Jay, I'm usually a fillet player, and for engineers, I'm usually a pin vice player. So, we've got... Both of the original Season 1 captains who are going to be making an appearance. We've got Blister, who's really good at range. He is supported by Hoist and Ratchet with their kind of long blast earth abilities. Compound as a goalie, just to be an annoyance because those butchers are super quick. Mother, who is basically the secondary striker and obviously the wonders that is Velocity on the wing. So really excited to have a look at these guys and see how they do. So we will go over to the roll-off next. Right then, onto the roll-off, mate. Let's do it. A two, a six. six. I will receive the ball. You'll receive the ball, okay? So we'll go to the kickoff, start the game. Okay then, so for me, Ballista is going to kick off. He's got a five-inch base move, just onto this beautiful widget here. And as you can see, we've pre-measured, he's going to attempt to kick it over to that flank. So he's got a four-dice kick, which he is successful with, mate. Barely. Uh, so green for direction. In three, four inches. I'm going to re-roll it. Famous last words. In the four, six inches. That's better. So, four, six. Just centre on that bit of terrain there. And we will go to the influence allocation for the first turn. And this is how things look at the start of the first turn. So what's your plans here, mate? You've realised the ball's gone a bit astray. Yeah, I kind of deployed, after saying, yeah, I'll receive the ball, I deployed as if it was kicking, which wasn't the strongest start. So you took uh, the denied flank route. Yeah, so I'm miles away from the ball, so I'm just going to do what butchers do. So you just stacked up to try and get in and get I'm some damage. I'm just going to get in, see if I can get some damage off this turn. I've gone for two on Spider for ball retrieval, and then the standard kind of range play. We've got four on Ballista for his dead bot in his minefield. Four on a hoist to Nick Ratchet's blasting and three on Ratchet for blasting as well. And then Velocity and Compound are just going to do their standard thing. So we'll go to the first activation of turn one, which will be the Butchers. All right, so Brisket is literally just going to sprint forward uh, eight inches, staying within eight of the edge like she likes to. Um, I really have no idea what to do, so I'm trying to get Tom to commit something. Panic setting, hasn't it, Jay? Yeah, it has a little bit. Back to the engineers. Easy peasy one for me, Compound is simply just going to move so the back of his base is only just within four inches of the goal token so that he has got his rush keeper ready to go. Back to you mate. Okay, so Princess is going to be the world's best intervening model and just shuffle back in front of my goal. Beautiful. Simple. Over to Velocity then, he's got a base six inch move and she's going to move herself into cover and within Compound's kind of protection snuggle blanket bubble. Patented. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to go with Meat Hook, who's got three on her. I'm going to spend the first one to two lock board just in cases. Um, she's then going to spend one to sprint eight to, sorry, just nudging the widgets, but just here outside of Compound's counter charge, and her third one is wasted. That's her done. Okay, so you can see we've planned out the spider's activation here. It is going to spend one influence, 
to sprint seven inches just on top of that marker there. It's going to chuck out some webbing within four inches here, and then it is going to use the webbing ability to remove this marker to take control of this ball because it is within two inches of the spider. And then she is going to attempt to kick it, as you can see here, kind of towards the team. So she's got a two dice kick, I believe, yep. Yeah. And she has failed that kick. Good. So green for direction as Six. normal. Two and two. Uh, so that will basically centre just between the boys there. And that'll do for her. All right, so I'm going to go with Ox. Um, I feel a bit out of options. Um, and I'm going to start. The walls are crushing in, Jay. They are, they are. Um, I'm going to start by taking um, my sprint, stopping just outside of um, counter charge range, which costs one. I'm then going to do butchery for two on uh, Ballista. He's a three plus. And that is Slightly success. off camera, but he gets it. Uh, so we pop that there. And then I'm going to spend my last one to put tough skin on one of us, probably myself, because people like to kill captains. And that's it. Okay. Okay, so Ratchet is up next. He is going to spend one of his influence to tool up a hoist. We all know what's coming next. He's going to walk five inches just to that position there. And spend his two to chuck out a blast earth just over to Ox and Meat Hook. So, two dice needing fours for Meat Hook. Mm -hmm. And that is a hit, so that's two damage to her. Cool. And I get a point of momentum because of momentous inspiration. And then I'm going to try and hit Ox. Threes. Two damage to him. Okay. Happy times. Mm. So, two damage taken each. And that'll do. Okay, so I've given up trying to figure out what I can do because there isn't anything I can. So, we're just going to push up for turn two with Boar taking a sprint to here, and he's done. So Hoisty Babes is up next. He is going to move just to that position there, picking up the ball and then dropping it at Ballista's feet. He's going to true replicate off Ratchet his Blast Earth, and then he's going to spend two influence to drop it in exactly the same spot. So two dice needing a four to hit Meat Hook has not. Two dice needing a three to hit Ox has. That'll be three damage because he's tooled up. Okay. And a point of momentum for me because of momentous inspiration near Ballista. And then I'm gonna spend two to do it again. So, <laughs> two dice on Meat Hook, needing a four. Oh, Snake Eyes. Meat Hook's dodging these. Uh, Ox, no, did not get the momentum for that then. Um, but he's done a bit of blasting, he's done a bit of earthing. He's blasted some earth. All right, so my last activation is Gutter, and following the theme of everyone else, she's just going to sprint forwards eight, ready to wreck face at the start of turn two, and that's me done. Okay, Ballista is up next, and he's going to try and do something relatively good. So he's going to go for a dead bolt for two influence, snapping the ball, obviously, if he hasn't already. Uh, so two dice, looking for a three on Ox. Gets it, thank God. That is going to be three damage, mate. Yep. Uh, a two inch push directly backwards and the knocked down condition. So would you be so kind just to push him back two inches? I will take care of that mate, no problem. Chuck him back two inches for me. Yeah. Uh, now that is a once per turn ability. So, uh, what Ballista is then going to do, he's got a five inch move, but he might need more of that. I do get a point of momentum for that actually because he's momentous inspiration. Mm -hmm. He's inspired himself. Mm. Um, five inch move, eight inch charge. You've not got any momentum, have you, mate? Zero. Um, oh, decisions, ladies and gentlemen. Don't really want the passing blow there. He's going to charge into Boar, I think, if we can. Yeah, we would ignore Gutter's melee range. Go along that way there. Yep. If you're happy with that. Yeah, fine, right. Just outside the inch. Well, just inside the inch, sorry. Yep. And uh, inside the 10. Mm -hmm. You happy with that? All good. So, six dice, plus four for the charge, against threes and one for ball. Yep, I'll do my uh, poised free counter attack. You do your poised free counter attack, will you? New rule. So, I'll tell you what, I'll roll them behind here, we've got space. Threes and one. Oh, so oh, many twos. Beautiful. Tom's dice rolling. Uh, take the one away for armor, that's four hits. Um, it's going to be... A momentous 
two damage, double push. I'm just okay. going to chuck him two inches back there. So he's away. I am then going to trigger my legendary play, nice. which is going to be Breach. And he gets to make a kick without using influence. It gets plus four inches, it's a 10 inch kick. Can't be interceptive. Intervening models can uh, get knocked down by it. So he's got four dice kick. I do have to spend my momentum mm -hmm. to make the kick to make the shot on goal. Uh, four dice, clear all this stuff out the way. The temptation is to bonus time it here, but I could do, do with the uh, I could do with the advantage for next turn. Yeah, so I'm gonna just risk it. Oh, gets, gets the goal, it. so that's momentum back. And four points on the board, and I think Ballista is tactically going to spend that momentum to make a four inch dodge. Out of the way. And I think he might he might just uh, back away just to this piece of cover here. And we'll tidy up and we'll go to the kick out and the game plan deck next. Okay then, so the ball is just scattered out onto the halfway line and Brisket has rightly snapped it. We've knocked Princess down from the breaching kick. Yep. And we are on to the game plans, mate. So, mutual reveal. Mm -hmm. uh, we'll just stop on one camera, I've decided Brisket. Ready? Yep. Go. Oh, oh you're going to get it. So that takes my three. five up to eight. So. Go for the knees, one friendly non-captain model coming on the pitch gains plus one tack. I'll tell you who that is in a second once I've made a decision. Uh, yep. And you've gone grudge match. We both choose a player on each team and they get singled out. It starts with you because you have initiative. But you're on minus one influence for the turn. Yeah, so, I, I wanted to try and get that goal with brisket just so to balance the books a little bit. We'll make some decisions and we'll go to influence allocation for turn two. I'm definitely going first. Yep. Okay, and this is how things look at the start of the second turn. And we'll go for the buffs that we've just had from our card. So I've given plus one tack to velocity, mm -hmm. which you might need it. Yep. Uh, singled out has gone an ox. Death sentence. <laughs> you didn't need ox. that. Didn't need that. <laughs> and, and I've put, put my singled out over on velocity as well. So we're thinking blister going into ox and brisket going into velocity. That's how it looks, yeah. In terms of influence, six on blister because of that. Um, two on velocity for maybe a snap back, run up with the goal. Two on hoist and two on mother, essentially whichever way the ball goes out. One on compound in case he needs to wade in or free himself from combat. Mm -hmm. One on ratchet potentially if he needs to tool up or come into it. How about you, mate? So I've got three on meat hook. I'm going to go and basically I need to start putting some pain out Some there. hooked and stuff. Hooked, some bleeding. We've got three on meat hook. None on ox, hoping you'd leave him alone, but you're not that stupid, I don't think. <laughs> One on boar because always uh, we've put four on exile gutter. Beautiful uh, gutter. Beautiful gutter. Uh, and we've got three on brisket ready to hopefully take a goal. So yeah, you're suffering from the minus one influence here, aren't you as well, mate? Yeah, so I'm down to 11 this turn, although uh, everyone I want to have them is kind of maxed. Got, yeah, she's so, ox, hasn't got anything. If yeah. I can remove that aura, then I'm okay for a little while. I think so. So, go on to the first activation of turn two. Okay, and we'll start turn two predictably with Ballista wading into Ox. Captain on captain, mate. Yep. So, five inch move will get me just to there. I've got six tack base, plus two for the singled out, and because you're knocked down, twos and one. Correct. So, so mission I can do about it. Have a swing and see how we get on. Uh, everything, so take the oh. one away. Two, four, seven. six, and seven. We've got a playbook of six, that is a wrap. Uh, <laughs> I'll take the momentous three with a one inch push and the non momentous one, so that's four damage, mate. Would you like to push me backwards? Uh, no, I think you're alright where you are, to be honest, mate. Uh, and that knocks you down to uh, seven. Seven. Uh, we will swing again. Both <laughs> left. Dun, 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 dun. Needing those twos. One miss that time. One away for armor. Six. Is six. So full playbook. I'll take the momentous three. Yeah, that leaves him on four. Uh, swing again. Poor Ox. Poor Oxy boy. It's that dead bolt. Luckily, that here mm. the last turn. Uh, oh, three ones there. We roll that one. Oh, you're too kind. Uh, two away. That's why I lost the game. Didn't I? Just knock that everywhere. One. So that's uh, five hits. Mm. I'll take the non momentous three. Down to one health. One health. Now you're going to leave him alone, right? And then I am. I'm just going to cuddle him for a little bit. Eight going to tell him everything's going to be okay. Eight ones. Eight ones. Um, no. No. <laughs> <laughs> one away. One, two, three, four, five, six. Um, yeah, I'll take the Momentous 3. He dies. Which get Momentum and the Momentum for the kill. Puts me up to 6 in the pink. And I've got 2 influence left. Now, am I within 8 inches of brisket? Oh. Um, oh, I 
think I am, mate. Yeah, it's all good. So I'm going to attempt to, I'm just going to tilt the camera ever so slightly. Apologies, folks. Go with that. I'm going to try and deadbolt brisket. I don't think I lose any dice with gutter in the way, do no. I? So we'll say no. We'll say no. So two dice. Oh, God. Uh, Fours. And I'm going to bonus time it. Absolutely. To try and make sure I hit. So I need a four plus off three dice. And oh, yes, that is momentum because of momentous inspiration. That is two, uh, three damage, mate. Yep. Uh, a two inch knock back directly away and knock down. So we'll see where the ball scatters and we'll cut back in a second. Okay, you can just see where the ball has scattered. I'm quietly lamenting not putting up minefield here, but uh, <laughs> the ball scattered in front of Brisket, who's now on her backside. So you're gonna use your momentum to stand up, are you, mate? I um, I didn't want to go with Brisket until I had to because she had her unpredictable to protect her, um, and we did just think this was out, so we remembered she charges for one less. So yeah, she's been eight. So yeah, so we'll spend the momentum I have to stand up, and she's gonna charge just to this spot. Yeah, just so outside of compounds to counter charge. Yeah, so I she will. has a nine dice charge up to eleven Starts. because of. Good on. Yep. I will take offensive stance because velocity makes sense. So, so it's nine dice charge up to eleven for singled out, down to ten for cover, and it's sixes. Sixes. I need. And you take the ball with you. So you got all the space there, mate. Good luck. And oh, gets, gets his two. two. So I will take the momentous one with a one inch dodge. Okay, do you want me to dodge you towards the goal? I might stay in and hit you again because I've got two left. So you dodge me towards the goal, but keep me in your melee. Okay. All right. So out of compound. Oh, it's a well, compound can't count yeah, to charge you anyway. So dodge. literally, if I just dodge you there, perfect. Cool. I'll then buy a swing, which will be six dice after calculating the cover and the other bits, and this one fives. Five zero, right? Five zero, mate. Yes. Boom. That's that one. And we get two hits. We'll take another. Momentous one with a one inch dodge. Are you going to get out of my belly zone this time? I imagine. So just there. I think you're clear there. And, and then, then you are within eight. Yeah, I'll spend my last one to take a shot. So one for the momentum. Would you like to bonus time it, Jay? I don't know. <laughs> the, old, uh, the old pool trick. Uh, let's see. I like having momentum. Um, Do you like scoring goals? No, I'm feeling brave. Okay, go for it. Three so dice is enough. Three dice. Yeah. Famous last words. Easy. Oh! <laughs> The most famous of last words. Just out of curiosity. No, I just. <laughs> <laughs> All the twos. Thank you, kickoff. Uh, so where's, it, where's it gonna go, mate? Where's it gonna go? I don't care. <laughs> Direction, please. Oh, wow. You can end up in a ring. I want my dice back. Direction, two. <laughs> two inches, please. Two. Three. Three. Um, it's just gonna bounce off, right? I think. Yeah, it's gonna hit. Clip there. I yep. Think, uh, oh. oh, brisket. Oh, good. Cool. All right, that is her very done. That's the engineer, sir. So, Velocity's up next. She's going to spend one of her influence to sprint in a zigzag to this position here, snapping the ball. She's going to spend another one to kick it in this direction over here. The temptation is to kick it to Ratchet, um, who could make a four inch dodge, but to be honest, Mother is more of a pain. I'll tell you what, no, we will try and kick it to Ratchet because then we get momentum anyway that we can make use of. So, four dice kick. Uh, does succeed. Get a point of momentum, but I will spend it with immediacy to make a four inch dodge. If I can find my four inch stick, there we go. Just to dodge Ratchet up to that position there. And we will go back to you, mate. All right, did, can I have to go with Meat Hook because I don't want it to be 10 nil yet. So she <laughs> is gonna walk to this here, which we've pre-measured, and she's gonna buy an attack on Ratchet. Anything from you, buddy? Yeah, I'm gonna counter attack, I think. I'm regretting not giving it to Hoist. <laughs> yeah, right, so threes and one, correct? Threes and one, yes. Smash. Oh. So that one misses and that one's on. So I get four. Uh, where is she? I'm going to take uh, of course, I'm going to take the momentous tackle. Okay, so ball goes back to you. Mm -hmm. I've got five tack needing fours and one. Yeah. Oh dear. One hit. One hit is yeah. going to be one damage to her. No problem. I'll mark that now. Just don't forget. It's down to 11. It does. And then she'll buy another swing on I am hooked and bleeding, aren't I? Yes, you are. I'm down to twos and one now. Twos and one. So, twos and one. Cut my off camera, but oh, still four. Four hits there. Yep, sorry. Uh, I will take. Momentous two. 
puts me down to 15 with a one inch push. Um, we'll just push you to there. Yep. Okay with that. And then I'm going to spend my last one to kick the ball. And I'm going to kick the ball. So I'm very prepared. Six inch kick. Yep. Can, there we go. There you go. Somewhere over there. Away is where I'm going to kick the ball. Yeah, we'll go there. Okay, I'll put a scatter there. You're not being engaged, so you've got your normal no. three dices. So, orange dice for direction. You've got to roll to see if you succeed first, mate. Oh, correct. Uh, how many dice are we on? Three, three. I think, for me. So, is it accurate? It is. It is. Orange dice for direction. Five and five. I don't like that. Uh, you can re-roll it if you don't like it. Five and five would put it along Blister's ball path. Yeah, I'm re-rolling that. Uh, orange for direction. Two and four. That's uh, marginally better. Marginally but we're better. keeping it. Two and four, pops it there. No problem. And that is meat hook done. Okay, we're gonna go with Hoist next, Jake. He's gonna yep. spend one to sprint seven inches just to get within an inch of the ball. Lovely. And he's gonna spend a second one to try and boot it into space onto this wing. Because I think yeah. we just set off camera, Jay. You're kind of chasing the ball. Yeah, you're chasing I'm activations. Playing activation behind here. So four dice kick uh, is a fail. Good. Uh, so green for direction, six and one, that's fine. Six and one, it'll go there. Meat Hook could snap it if she wanted to. Mm, I'm gonna figure that out off camera. No worries, <laughs> be back in a sec. Right, so Meat Hook hasn't snapped it. We've done a lot of measuring with Gutter, haven't we, mate? Do you wanna talk the people through? I think actually Meat Hook is going to snap it. You are going to snap it. Given, yeah, given the conversation I've just had, so... Gutter was thinking about grappling through here, she's got counter charges she's and gonna parting blows. She's going to do a grapple hook of hoist for about half an inch to stay <laughs> out of um, counter charge, but then the ballista parting blow to go and get the ball. The problem is I'm chasing the ball, yep. and it's making things tough, so I'm going <laughs> to do what I do best, do what which is do. Boar is just going to charge you here. I'm right. going to take a defensive stance to put me on two fours and one. Fours and one with bucket of dice. Oh, lots of ones and yeah. threes. You're gone, you're No gone. twos this time, though. No twos. Yeah, they, I've used them up. I've got tough hide okay. if that helps. Gone. You. And one for answer. Four hits. Boar will take the momentous three damage. Down to two. Uh, you get your three. Mm -hmm. He did have an influence on him, didn't he? Yeah, he did. He charged, off. He charged for three, remember, so you Spoilers, that's what's coming. Ah, okay. <laughs> uh, it's Berserk Attack. Uh, threes and one. Five hits, uh, momentous three again. Down to two, and then you've got your normal attack. Mm -hmm. So just your normal eight attack. Uh, three is one away. Four. I'm getting that four away. Momentous right, three. Down to two, got 12 left. And then one. And then my berserk. Uh, three. Oh, uh, uh, three hits. Momentous two. Let's try and get ahead of the next turn. Eleven left on Ballista. And that is the horrific boar charge done. Okay, Ratchet is up next. He is going to make a move just around here to meet Hook. He's got one influence on him, so he's going to take a swing at him. And I will take a counter attack. I'm going to go in both base to base, actually. Uh, five attack, needing fours and one. Uh, three, one, single point of damage to a mate. Okay. And then my counter attack? Yes. Three and one, or oh, two and one, I'm hooked. Five. Uh, momentous, so it's not momentous, but two damage with the two inch push. Two damage with the two inch push. And I will push you to there. Okay. Uh, I think Ratchet is going to spend a momentum to put overclocked on the spider. Gives it a free sprint or charge. All right, nice simple one. The dog is forfeiting to stand, so he can hopefully be an intervening model this time. <laughs> right, the spider is going to use its overclocked free charge to charge at Meat Hook through the gap it can just about make to there, mate. Anything? Defensive counter. Defense and counter. Ooh. Absolutely. Fives and one. Fives and one. Three dice base plus four for the charge. Mm -hmm. uh, oh. Oh, one. It's going to be the tackle, though, to annoy you. So tackle on one hit, I'll take. 
okay. nine momentous, and then you've got your attack back. I'm not quite in the cover, sadly. All right, so six dice needing needing fours and one. Oh, one. Oh, I didn't do it. <laughs> that is a glorious one damage. Oh, with damn bleed. Correct. Uh, we'll mark them on at the end because I think I've only got one hook token. No problem, I'll take the one damage. We can, uh, they can share that. That's cute. Um, I need to plan a little bit here, Jay. Yeah, so, that's all right. Four dice kick. I don't think I can get a nest marker where I want it to be. That's a shame. Oh, yeah, I can. Hang on. That's not a shame. Hang on. Oh, what do you need? Bear with us, ladies and gentlemen, on camera. I need to remove that base. Yep. So, yeah, four to put a nest marker. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, like a glove. So, I've got one momentum for this, so this is the issue. So, I'm going to spend nothing to put a nest marker out there. Mm hmm. I'm going to spend one influence to burrow, which mm -hmm. allows me to appear yeah. there and gets rid of the nest marker. Within four inches of the goal, princess is not in the way. Influence and a momentum. Yeah. Um, to tap try in. and have a tap in. Only on two dice though, Jay. Two dice kick. Needing a three. Oh, I'm just going to scoot horrific. the camera up. Needing a three plus. Gets hey, it. gets it. And that is point momentum back. And another four VP, which I will oh. take. And uh, how much momentum are you on, mate? You've got a gazillion uh, momentum. Four now, because I used two to try and negate that. Um, I will keep hold uh, of. Actually, no, you're going to generate loads, though, aren't you? Uh, I'll leave the spider where it is. It's in tapping range. Okay. So we'll go back to you. Deliberations from Jay here. Yeah, so the end is nice. Turf hoist, doesn't it? It's a snap to him. Yeah, I mean, where I'm going to go is the same, but the plan was me having the ball. <laughs> um, Ideal scenario. Mm, go to Tacos on four as well, just going to make this stuff. But she's going to charge because she needs... Let's see the new girl in action then. She's going to charge to this spot here. She's engaging compound. Yeah. Yep, so you can't counter charge But her. she's charging hoist. I'll take a defensive stance to make me fives and one. All right, so I've bonus timed this. Um, so it is tack five. Up to nine, down to eight. You spent your momentum for your yeah, bonus. Gone. Oh, it's gonna hurt. Then fives and one, needing uh, four hits, ideally. Yeah. Eight dice. Yep. Oh, needing four hits for this. Okay. Or five hits because you'll want the one for the armor. I think fives and it. one. Fives and one. And one. Got it. Good girl. She'll take the momentum to tackle. Boom. All right. Now she's gonna buy a swing. So it's only four dice because. Again, compound, so she'll buy a swing. Yep. Uh, uh, down to fours and one now, mate. Fours and one. Nothing. Uh, nothing. She's gonna spend the last one to pass it to Brisket. She's got a six inch kick, which she's Good. comfortably in. She'll bonus time it, because we made that mistake once. So how many dice are you rolling, mate? She's rolling three, up three. to four. Four dice, there you go. Uh, but I am engaged. So you lose dice. Yep, so it's back to three. Good luck. Kick to Brisket. Yeah. Gets oh, a five and a four, success. They get a point of momentum. I'm gonna spend two. For a snapshot. To try and blast it, so. I'm gonna bonus time a snapshot. You're gonna bonus time a snapshot. Four dice. Four dice. In two fours. Two fours. Good luck, mate. Come on, baby. <gasps> Gets it. it. Bangs it in. Well done. So it's point momentum back to you. Correct. Would you like to dodge or anything? Four, no, four VVP, most importantly. As well. It's not 12 0 now. I can breathe. Uh, she's good where she is. Awesome. So we'll go to the engineers who will kick it out. And after that amazing screamer goal there from mm. Brisket, set up by the wonderful gutter. Uh, the ball's just scattered over to Meat Hook as it's been booted out by the engineer. So Compound is going to spend his one to sprint seven inches to just annoy her and harass her. <laughs> and we will go to the game plans. Yeah. And end the turn. Right, so we've got to the end of the second turn. Score is currently 10 to 4, Jay. Correct. Bleed has gone onto the spider and onto Ratchet. They've taken a little bit of hurt. We're onto the game plan. So Jay has got three momentum advantage here. So again, we'll chuck them either side of the halfway line. You ready for this? Yeah, go for it. Bam! Oh, you've gone for another minus one influence. I one. have to play it safe for the plus six. I've gone for the plus three. So I've gone for midfield general, which gives me a plus one, plus one move for everybody. Wow, and mine, when I score a goal, I can run the length without spending MP. Ooh, do you want to go first or second for this game, then? <laughs> Let me sit first. First, okay. Absolutely. So we'll go to the influence allocation for turn three. Okay, and this is our influence allocation at the start of turn three, because EJ is already planning out his actions. So yeah. Ox has came back on at the back of the pitch. What else have we got planned there, mate? We've got three on Meatlock, is that? We've got three on Meatlock. Meat Meatlock's going to have to go. She has to play a bit of passing game, isn't she? She is, and I think her only option is to run to where you can see the coin and 
hit hoist and see what happens. But we've got three on meat hook, one on bork as always. Nothing on these two at the back. Uh, we've got four on gutter and four on the wonderful brisket. Yeah, we've just said your minus one hasn't really made much of a difference. Now brisket scored a goal. She's bringing two she brought extras, two extras, hasn't she? Extras, yeah. I've she got helped. four on velocity just in case anything bad happens to you because mm -hmm. she's great at getting the ball with the tackle double dodge. Mm. Four on hoist, six on blister. Would probably kill meat hook is potentially yeah, nothing on compound which I might regret but we'll see how we go. So we go to the first activation of turn three which would be the butchers. All right, so Meat Hook's gonna go and she'll spend the first point moment to run to this point here. And then in sheer desperation, she's gonna kick the ball to Gutter. To Gutter. <laughs> so you go down to one dice because you're engaged by Hoist and Compound. Not even worried. <laughs> uh, put that in shot. I'm a little bit worried. Where's it gonna go, mate? <sighs> Direction. One, two, three, you're okay. Two. Direction two. Distance two. Two. So. It will go along that path, which will go over gutter. Mm -hmm. You happy for it to snap it, or do you yeah, want to? Yeah, I am. Um, annoyingly, I wanted the momentum for a dodge, but what can you do? And then Meat Hook will spend her last one to hit hoist, and it'll be minus one dice because of compound. Yes. So what uh, do I need to hit you? Fours and one? Fours and one, mate. No problem. Oh, no problem at all. Uh, so two hits. That is okay. That is a momentous one damage with the hooked and bleed. Uh, he won't take the damage because it's tough hide, but he, see, I'm done the damage. Oh, and I'm going to take something different then. Uh, one inch push. One inch push. Yeah. Where would you like to push me? There. Okay. At there, actually. Okay. Bring you into base. All right, we'll go over to the engineers for the next one. Mm -hmm. Okay, I might regret ignoring the uh, footballing game in a second, but Ballista is going to go first. He's going to take a swing at Boar. Which is one, two, three, four, five, six dice, plus one for a bonus time. Threes and one on big man. Correct. Threes and O. Oh. Threes and O. Oh. Mm. oh, so many misses. Three hits. Is his knockdown? Thank God. So I'll knock him bum. on his bum. And then hook. Blister's going to freely move away into base contact. He can just about get around here. Sounds like a. Canyon has just collapsed in the background there. It does. He's gonna have a swing at meat hook. So, one here. He's got six attack base plus two friendly friends. Okay. And he's after fours and one. Do it. Do it, do it, do it. Oh, it's not great. We roll that one. So, thank you, sir. Uh, nope. So, two hits is gonna be one damage. I'm just gonna have to take the damage. Okay. Swing again. Got nine left. I don't think I can do it. I'd have to roll out. It's like fours and one. Mm, let's hope. Uh, one hit again. After all these dice, Whoa. there's going to be another one damage. Okay, eight left. Tom's dice rolling. Swing again. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, man. It's awful, isn't it? Two, one damage. Yeah, she's on seven. Seven. She's somehow getting out of this. <laughs> oh, I have no idea what to do. I couldn't. It's whether to just deadbolt or chuck up a minefield or something. Mm. Um, yeah, I am going to chuck up a minefield just for the sake of guaranteeing a bit of damage. So two. And that means anyone who walks, starts an activation or walks within four inches of blister takes four damage. So if she heals, then I could potentially wail on it, even though she's already gone. Bad activation blister. Bad one. Mm. Can't right. believe that. Can't that was believe that. that was Tom Dice finally kicking in. I've been waiting for some Tom Dice. Bloody horrendous that was. It was so. Right. Gutter's free at the moment. Gutter is unengaged. Um, she's going to make the use of her two-inch melee, and she's going to start by charging velocity, um, putting herself out of velocity's melee in tapping range. Yeah. Uh, just ready for when. So she is nine dice with the charge. What do I need on velocity, bud? Uh, fives, mate. No so, armor. So that's two gone for the charge. Fives. <gasps> one. One. It's all right. Uh, momentum's one damage. Okay. Whew, we got some momentum. Plus it adds eight. I'll buy an attack <laughs> with my third. And we have four dice. I have that all important momentum. Uh, fives. Better. Three. There we go. Momentum's two. Puts it down to six. I will then, with my last, take a shot. Uh, Do you want a bonus? bonus time? <laughs> yeah. I'm going to pull it. I'm going to bonus time it. So it is. Four dice, needing threes. Needing a three plus. Swingy game. Nails Gets it. Gets it. That's um, another four points. 
Also, because of my game plan card, I can run the length without spending yeah. a beat. So you can do a four-inch dodge. I'm going right in front of you. There. Ooh, okay, so we'll boot it back out and see what the engineers do next. We can see Hoist Master plan here as the ball has just been kicked out. So he's going to take a swing at Meat Hook for an influence. He's got five attack base, but he gets another one. I'll counter attack for what it's worth. You are going to counter attack. So I get six, actually, got seven attack because compound's there as well. Yeah, he is. That annoying fours and one. Uh, Gusta should have taken four damage, I've just realised, from the minefield. Go on, we'll uh, take it right now. But it's not that it mattered. <laughs> it would have affected yep. her kick. Fours and one, better. Uh, one away is three hits. I will take the momentous push dodge. So I'll dodge hoist for you because we know where it puts her. Just dodge her. Uh, we wanted so to do that. So that will ignore the counter attack. Yep. I am then going to spend another one to sprint now because I've got plus one to my move mm. because of my plot card. I get there. Yep. I've got two dice. Um, I couldn't have stolen anything good off someone, really. I could have potentially gone for an acrobatic, but maybe not. So I'm just going to swing. Not swing, but shoot. Swing, you've called it. With my momentum, my three and my four dice will go down to three because the doggy. doggy is in the path. Can you do it to close the game? Oh, oh. I can. Handshake okay. on camera, mate. Great game. I thought it was going to go back the other way. <laughs> so we'll go to the post match interviews in a second. And we're back. We are. That swung that game. That. I picked up towards the end, it really did. It was looking like everything was lost. It was one of those things where the lineup screwed you over a little bit at the start. Guaranteed that goal. Oh, yeah. But then after that, yeah, it was a nightmare. Turn, turn one obviously was a pain. Everything just moved forward. Top of two losing Ox because you got the uh, dead bolt off yeah. at the end of one, which put him down, um, which left me in a bad spot. And it was 10 0 at one point. That's all Blister did though, because he it lost his attacks. Meat Hook would not go down. Um, turn two was interesting because I was always kind of chasing the ball every activation and you were just playing interference. Um, but then those two goals at the end. Uh, Gutter. Gutter. Oh, what a debut. Yeah, she did all right. She set a snapshot up and scored on herself. Yeah, her and Brisket worked out really nicely together. She's got such range, even the measuring in between mm -hmm. the activations. We mentioned it on camera. Yeah. She has such range in the grapple look and things it like that. It just gives you really a lot better. of movement options. Yeah, um, compound is not great either when you've got someone who can move that far. Very true. But uh, thank you again, mate. No, you're welcome. Good for uh, as always. Uh, we'll go on to, well, hopefully this will be up before Paul's one, but Paul's mm -hmm. playing Bryce. So we'll go check out how that's going. We'll go check out how that's yeah. going. We'll see you later. Cheers, guys. Hi, guys. Thank you very much for supporting our channel. It means the world. If you'd like to watch some more video content from us, there's some links over there. If you'd like to support the channel, you can look in the description for Patreon and merchandise and all manner of lovely things. See you later.